The Silver Cup Handicap Chase is next. This is a three-mile handicap. 0 to 130. I've got a strange number there. Normally 120, 140, 160. I very often get them 130. But this one is. And Bridge Paul is at the top for Darren Thompson. Giran Citizen, David Robertson, Blossom World, David Hooley, Nocdolian Robin, James Shea, San Pedro, Patty, Vinnie Gerard, Dressed to Impress, Craig Beckwith, The Go Between, and Elvis for Martin Lidham, Sizzling Tail for Paul Parsons, Langley Streak, and Marge Tick for Graham Clutterbuck, Tunisia for Matt Cooper, Fearless Paul Parsons, Ultimate Way, Leon Van Rensburg, and Alex Cherry's got the bottom two, Winning Brillant, and Violet's No Weighty. A big field of 16 for this, and away they go. And they get to the first, and they're also here with the first with Nocdolian Robin and Bridge Paul disputing it from Marsh Tit and the go between. Rather surprisingly, Elvis last. He's normally a front runner, he's now being driven up the inside, so if he can get to the lead, that'll be interesting. They get over the second, and they're all safely over the second with Bridge Paul the leader, and Elvis is using a lot of energy to try and get to the lead with his boxing and can't get past horses so they get to the third which is the first of the ditches and they're all over that one safely with bridge pull the leader of oh, nocdolian robin and then winning brillant san pedro patty and the go between as they get over the fourth which they again all got over nicely dressed to impress and fearless just the back two also towards the rear sizzling tail i'm going to try not to call the sizing tail today although all parts of this is going to call one size in town next year, so that'll be interesting, especially if they both end up in the same race. And it's Bridge Paul in front. Elvis has now got through into second, and he's almost certainly going to be driven up to challenge Bridge Paul for the lead. Nocdolian Robin is back in third, then winning Brillant and the go between San Pedro Paddy is after that one as they get to the fifth, which they all step over nicely, all still on their feet, all jumping well as they get to the sixth with Bridge Paul the clear leader. Elvis is in second, the go-between made a mistake. Sizing, sizzling, I <laughs> did it again. Then goes Nocdolian and Robin, they get over the hurdle. And there's a faller there this time, winning Brillant has gone. So the first of Alex Cherry's two is out as they get to the eighth with Bridge Paul in the lead. Elvis is much closer in second now, then Nocdolian and Robin is third. And we lost Langley Streak there as well. Sizzling Tail has moved into fourth. Then Tunisia and Fearless, they're getting quite strong out now as the pace is quite hot, so Bridge Paul obviously keen to keep hold of that lead for Darren Thompson, Elvis is in second, then comes Nocdolian Robin back in third, Sizzling Tail is fourth, then comes Tunisia on the outside of Fearless, the go-between is after that as they take the next, which they all get over safely, they're racing up the straight now, and Bridge Paul is only a length clear, of Elvis in second, who's five lengths clear of Nocdolian Robin. This next fence will be the last on the next circuit. And then all over it, okay. With Bridge Paul, a length clear of Elvis in second. Then a six length gap to Nocdolian Robin in the green. Then the white jacket of Sizzling Tail in fourth. As they come up past the winning post. And prepare to swing right hand and just lose them behind the board for a second. See where they all are. Then it's Bridge Paul in front. Elvis is in second, then Nocdolian Robin is third. Sizzling Tail is four, and Tunisia is five. Fearless is six, and San Pedro Paddy is seven, and then Marsh is eight, and go between nine. Then Giran Citizen and Ultimate Way. After that one is Blossom World. And then I think we've got Violet's No Weighty and Dress to Impress just out the back of the screen at the moment. But it's Bridge Paul and Elvis who are now almost together from Nocdolian Robin as they get over the next. then. Fear, uh, size, sizzling Tail is back in fourth. Fearless is in fifth. Then the go between San Pedro Paddy. Ultimate Way starting to creep a bit closer. So to March Tit and Tunisia. As they head down towards the next. Another plain one. And Elvis chucked that one really well. And has now finally got himself a share of the lead. With Bridge Paul. Nocdolian and Robin back in third. And Sizzling Tail four. Heading down towards the next then and over that one they go they land together the leading pair Elvis on the outside bridge pull over on the far side on the rail five lengths back is sizzling tail in third then Nocdolian Robin ultimate way creeping ever closer as they get over the next then a bit of a slow jump on the inside there by fearless San Pedro Patty and the go between are trying to get into it and Violet's no weighty he's also creeping in there as well Blossom World has dropped out to the back and he's just 
rolling around on my track a little bit as Elvis and Bridgepool prepare to take this turn. It's Bridgepool on the inside, probably just in front of Elvis. A gap of five lengths then back to Sizzling Town, who's third. Then comes Ultimate Way in four and a go between him. Five knocked Oli and Robin has lost his place. Fearless is also dropping back a bit over the next they go and Elvis is now a length clear. Elvis has gone on from Bridgepool in second who's now been driven up on the outside to reach as they get over the 16th. They've just got four more to get over the leading pair are now being caught. It's Elvis in the lead though still from Bridgepool over the final ditch. Elvis landed in front from Bridgepool in second. The go between is in third then Sizzling Town. Knocked Oli and Robin getting back into it as they get over the third last as Bridgepool regains the lead and Bridgepool's gone on again from Elvis on the inside. The go between and Giran Citizen has come from nowhere. Then Sizzling Town knocked Oli and Robin and San Pedro Paddy after that ultimate way and dressed to impress probably between these but it's Bridgepool who's kicked on in front. Bridgepool has gone four or five clear again and racing towards the final two fences Bridgepool is clear by four from Sizzling Town and San Pedro Paddy knocked Oli and Robin and dressed to impress over the second last they go and it's still Bridgepool in front knocked Oli and Robin he's trying to close so too Sizzling Town the go-between's running on again so too dressed to impress they come to the final fence and it's Bridgepool in the lead from Sizzling Town the go-between and dressed to impress they race to this final flight f final fence in there and Sizzling Town takes it up Sizzling Town lands in the lead Sizzling Town from dressed to impress and Bridgepool and it's Sizzling Town who's racing up the hill towards the line dressed to impress he's trying to close these two are clear it's going to be Sizzling Town who's going to take it for Paul Parsons racing up towards the line Sizzling Town takes it dressed to impress his second Bridgepool is third the go between four close for five between San Pedro Pallion not only Royal and Gira and Citizen and the field will drop all the way back to the slightly disappointing Leon Van Rensburg who was in his ultimate way I think and it's a win for Paul Parsons, who's enjoying a great first season. Another big winner. Sizzling Town for Paul Parsons takes it. Dressed to impress second for Craig Beck with the bridge pull for Darren Thompson was third. The go between Martin was fourth. And San Pedro Paddy for Vinnie Gerrard was fifth.